Hey guys, this is MG with, with another tutorial whether how you can upgrade Windows 11 from 24H2 to 25H2 version. Well, recently Windows 11 25H2 stable version has been released by Microsoft and it's been provided on their website for public to upgrade. So before upgrading to 25H2 version, first check the Windows version you have installed on your system. So to check it, right click on your PC and go to properties. And here you can see that I have Windows 11 Pro 24H2 version installed on my system. Then you must check the default language of your Windows because if you install the new version in different language, you may lose some data. So to check it, either you can go to time and language under settings and then click on language and region to see the language. Or you can run command prompt as an administrator and then just write this command which I will provide in the description and press enter. And here you can see that the default language of my system is ENUS which is English United States. And then do check the Windows update if it's been provided in the updates already. And if it's not, open your search engine and search download Windows 11 and visit this Microsoft page. And here you can see that Windows 11 2025 updated version 25H2 is available to download and install. And there are three options you can use to download the file. Well, before installing, do check the Windows release information status for known issues that may affect your device. Also, you can go to upgrade to Windows 11 question and answer section for additional information. Anyhow, scroll down and I'm using disk image option to download the file. Now, click on this drop down and select Windows 11 multi edition and then click on confirm. It will start validating your request which may or may not take some time and if it stucks, try again after some time. Then it will ask you to select the product language. Here select the language according to the default language of your system which is English United States in my case and then click on confirm. It will start validating your request again and then give you a link to download the file. Remember, this link is valid for 24 hours only. So click on this button to download the file. Since it's a big file, it will take a while in my case. Well, just to let you know that if you are upgrading from Windows 10 to Windows 11, you can install the Windows 11 exactly the same way. The only difference you need to make sure is that the secure boot is on on your system and your system has UEFI BIOS mode. Anyhow, the file has been downloaded. And I'm bringing it to the desktop by cutting and pasting it. Now, create a new folder and name it exactly as the image file name. Then right click on the image file and extract the file in the folder you just created on the desktop. Now go to the folder and instead of running the setup file here, I'm going to the sources folder. Now run command prompt as an administrator.
here write cd dot dot and hit enter on your keyboard then write cd dot dot again and hit enter then write cd and add space now copy the address of the sources folder and paste it here and then hit enter now we are in the sources folder here write this command which i will provide in the description and hit enter now it will start preparing and downloading the windows 11 25 h2 file well if you don't want to download the updates concerning the 25 h2 version right away you can click on this link and select not right now to skip this step or save some time since I'm perfectly fine downloading the updates concerning the 25H2 version, I'm clicking on next. Here, accept the terms and conditions. Now, select the first option so that you can keep the files, settings and apps as they are. Remember, if you want to download the Windows 11 25 H2 version according to the default language of your system, you may not get all the three options. Anyhow, select the first option and click on Next. Now click on install to install Windows 11 25 H2 version. Well, it will take a while and your PC will restart several times. Now the 25 H2 version of Windows 11 has been installed and it's getting it ready. Now it's ready to use. First check the Windows version you just installed on your system. So to check it, right click on your PC and go to properties. And here you can see that the Windows 11 25 H2 version has been installed. Now check the default language of your system. And here you can see that it's English United States. Moreover, do check the Windows updates again. And here you can see that updates for Windows 11 25 H2 version are available, which you can download and install right away. Now, since the new version of Windows 11 has been installed, we don't need these files anymore. So we can delete them. and can start working on it right away. And this is how you can install or upgrade for Windows 11 24H2 to 25H2 version. And if you have stayed this far, please consider supporting by liking, subscribing, and sharing your thoughts in the comment section. And I hope this will be helpful for someone out there. And thanks for watching.